we had a client of ours, a marketing leadership team of a very large beauty company located in New York City, who did this exercise. And so they selected six words and they studied the impact of those words, those states of mind on decision making. So for example, they selected depressed and they noticed the impact that that had on their decision making. And this was a big aha for them as they went up the chain, they noticed that frustrated produced, you know, more disempowered decision-making. They noticed tired produced unsteady process. Then as they went above the neutral line, they noticed that content produced sort of balanced and measured decision-making, more patience, energized, produced a focused, collaborative, assured, and well thought through decisions. But interestingly, when they got to plus three, they noticed that they decided too quickly or they were overambitious, overzealous in their decision-making. So this was a way for them to study decision-making. They also studied collaboration, conflict management, leadership, the notion of time. And they came away with the same result, which was that when they were in a plus one, plus two state of mind, their decision-making, their collaboration, their overall approach to conflict management, et cetera, was more balanced.